right there. I feel like this one is not it. How's everybody doing? Welcome back to my channel. This week, we got a massive project going on. I got my client flying in from California for the next two days so we can do an outer sleeve cover-up. Oh my God. When I saw his email, I was like, yeah, he needs my help. He definitely needs my help. But first thing is first, for the first time in my videos, I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of uh, how we book appointments and how it goes down. So let's get this video started. <laughs> Las pantuflas does. <laughs> First thing is first, Oscar Baldonado. When, when is he for this week? Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. <laughs> That's the one with the emo hero. Let's go! <laughs> What's the emo say? Man, that sounds great, bro. You're like an angel in disguise. Like you say, let's go! Let's go! <laughs> and then he put, I ain't scared. <laughs> oh. Come on, let her be. <laughs> she goes no. back and smells it. Make sure it's fine. <laughs> Damn, what the? Serotonin? She, she has a better digestive system than I do, honestly. <laughs> Alright, so new client now. Alright. Okay, new clients. Hi there. I am looking to get this covered up. Is this something that can be done? Also, what are the rates and availability? Is it that? Okay, there's two nipples in this picture. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> two nipples? Two nipples. Technically, they don't belong to the same person. What? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> two nipples. <laughs> Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Reyes. My name is Alejandro and I live in Texas. I would like the possibility to have a booking session done with you. I would like a full right leg cover up with a Galaxy Space Astronaut thing. Oof. <laughs> did you just dab? I did. I got too excited. Galaxy thing with astronaut? You don't dab. Uh, Why are you dabbing? Also, it looks like you already had like a galaxy thing. Oh, it's a cover up, huh? It's not a, it's not a clean canvas. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I'll take it. I yeah? Like, yeah, I like the project. I'll take it. But did the uh, fox thing go all the way? <laughs> the fox? <laughs> it was, it, was it a fox? I thought it was a wolf. A wolf? <laughs> <laughs> a wolf? <laughs> <laughs> it's a wolf. I it's wolf. A, I can say it. <laughs> I wolf you. <laughs> Wait, you say it. A wolf. A wolf. Do you have any stories like how you got these tattoos maybe in a house or anything? No, yeah, yeah. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, I wanted um, I always wanted a, a, a O with a with a crown, right? Uh -huh. My name is Oscar, so let me get a nice O with a crown. Uh -huh. So uh, I didn't go to work one day. Right? I'm, I'm, I go I go chill with my boy. We at his house. And he was like, man, my, my boy, he down the street. He, he fresh out. He been doing tattoos in in, in the in, in the jail. Like, he, he got experience. So then we just go around the right, right around the corner, oh. and he's there, and um, we go to the backyard, and he he gets uh, the the little um, the bristle from the um, from the thing that you clean the uh, the uh, the grills with. He used that as a needle, oh, and God. he made the crown and the O with that. <gasps> so that's why you, <laughs> oh, if, no. if you touch it, you can feel it because that, that's what that's what he used. Oh. Can feel every line. You can use oh that. that that's God. where that came from. <laughs> you were bleeding, huh? Man, yeah, I was. Oh, or and, uh, you were I dripping. <laughs> 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 that's what he used. 
right here. He, uh, I wanted a, uh, I wanted it to be different. Uh -huh. I was like, let me get a rose with a skull coming out the middle of it, right? So he was like, yeah, I can do it. So we sitting there in, in his apartment. Uh -huh. um, he, he's, he, he was sipping on some, uh, some lean. Uh -huh. <laughs> he, was, he was creative that day. Yeah, he was creative. <laughs> <laughs> so he started, he, he get the paper, he put it down, he was like, that's how it's going to look. I'm like, oh, that's going to be sick. Yeah, that stencil <laughs> looks sick. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, but uh, then his daughter come out. Uh -huh. And she was, I think she was like, like maybe five. No. Five, maybe, maybe four, so five. <sighs> she comes, as he's tattooing. And oh. hops on his shoulder. No. <laughs> As he's tattooing, and I'm sitting, there, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, is, is, Are you gonna is say that cool? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, is that cool? He was like, don't worry, she does that all the time. Oh my god. I said, uh, I was like, all right, he know what he's doing then. <laughs> <laughs>
What are you craving? Hmm? What are you craving? What am I, huh? <laughs> what am I craving? Uh, nothing in particular. Nothing with chicken? <laughs> no, no, I said nothing in particular. Oh, nothing in particular. I was yeah. like, nothing with chicken. chicken. I was like, damn. <laughs> <That's> a... <laughs> How does it feel after a couple of years of not getting tattooed? Oh, it, it was, it was definitely sore. It's definitely sore. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what do you feel so far? Like, what area has been like, it's kind of like a little tricky, a little painful? I think uh, the back part. The back area, the tricep, huh? Yeah. It was... Oh, yeah. It's your fault. You, you're the one with the <laughs> tricep. With the tricep. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you come here with the tricep? <laughs> should have left it at home. Huh? <laughs> should have left it at home. <laughs> the number one thing about cover-ups is that once you're in it, like you don't know what obstacles you're going to come across because the only way to know how severe or how dark or how scarred a tattoo is is by actually doing it. And that's what's scary about cover-ups because you don't know. You don't know. And uh, with this one, there was a lot of gaps. And because there's a lot of open skin, you have to be consistent with your tones across the whole entire thing. And obviously, it, it, it is a cover-up, so you have to make sure that everything's covered up. But also, you got to make sure that to not make it look like a cover-up, make it look like it's a normal tattoo. Uh, my concern in this piece was the O, because they, they were very severe on his skin. Like, you can feel everything. But as soon as I started doing it, I realized that because it's been a couple of years, even though it's scarred, it's, it's pretty weak. Um, so I was able to just apply darker uh, solid ink and uh, counter it with some tones around it. And I was able to cover it up very easy. So I'm very happy about that. And now the easy part, the cross is gonna be easy. Uh, now I see that the O is not really that scary anymore. <laughs> now it's kind of like, ah, I got it, you know? But you got to keep in mind that you have to be ready for whatever, especially with this kind of projects, you know? Having a lot of open skin, a lot of tattoos all over the place. Stay consistent, my guys. Sounds like an ad. <laughs> Sounds like I'm promoting something. <laughs> Oh, that's a little tender there. <laughs> oh, right in the corner. The back, huh? the, back oh, the little back area. Right here. Hey. That tricep was killing you yesterday for sure. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> the placement is super dope too. Man. It just fits the form. This is a good spot to explain what I'm doing, take you guys uh, through my thought process. Then that's like a tongue twister. <laughs> take you guys through my thought process. So as you can see, there is a lot, a lot going on here. Star, lettering, line, the outline of the California state, a lot. But the one thing that I gotta point out, or the one thing I wanna explain is that even though it looks like a mess, you can use certain parts of this area, use the previous tattoo towards my advantage or to my advantage. How do, what, is, what sounds better? To my advantage? To my advantage. <laughs> Gotta practice. So in this case, the edge of this star, I'm, I'm, I made it into a, whisk, a whisker. I'm just gonna keep going. And now I'm gonna kind of curve the dark part of this area. I'm just gonna curve it just a little bit, just so we can take the shape of this corner here of the star, because it is such a straight line that you gotta you gotta erase that. There you go. I'm using a, a 14 mile liner with a five. 5.0 voltage and if you're new to my channel I use 5.0 voltage for every tattoo with every cartridge needle any size any part of the body no matter never changes boom so 
So I'm gonna carry this all the way down here. Do the same thing, overpower that black. I see this a little opening right here. Make it into a whisker. Why not? And erase that little corner. And then there is a straight line right here. And I see on my reference that there's like little spots around the the whiskers or around the mouth area there's a lot of spots so i'm gonna take advantage of that and i'm gonna do my own thing and on this corner uh, i'm gonna add one solid one here here you go add another one here and then do a longer one on this area that was not the same size every time it's not like a straight line of dots here i'm a Distract the eye by doing one, two, and a longer one. And a couple more spots here. It's all about distracting the eye from the whole entire shape. There you go. We're just gonna keep doing the same thing, adding my gray tones and making sure that it's not doesn't look dark. We gotta make sure to, we have to keep in mind the contrast of the whole thing. And um, yeah. I bet, you're, I bet you're sore, huh? Yeah, man. Hey, you're tired, look at your I eyes. I am tired, I've been my eyes, man. <laughs> you're tired. Six yeah. hours today, and then yesterday was seven? Seven. 13 seven. hours. 13 hours of pain, 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 pain. 13 hours later. That's considered torture in some places. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. That feels good, huh? Yeah. Kinda. <laughs> yeah. How does it feel? You're not having the old stuff anymore. Man, I don't even. I don't even want to think about that stuff. Man. <laughs> well, you're gonna not have feel... a whole ass YouTube video. What was the most painful part? The whole sleep. The 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 most painful uh -huh. was too low. It was the, the back the here, tricep, huh? the tricep, and then there was some areas right here. Mm. So it, it was real tender somewhere right here. Yeah. All right. You made it, man. You made it. Got my hands oh, swollen. Your hands are swollen. This <laughs> one. <laughs> You don't got a wrist anymore. It just goes from forearm to hand like. <laughs> <laughs>